In today's video, I'll be showing you on how can you actually disable Windows Defender on your Windows 11. But before we start, just a short message from our sponsor. CDKoffers.com is an all-in-one website where you could buy licensed keys. Just simply look for whichever software games you're looking for. Click on the Buy Now button. I know their licensed keys are already cheap, but want to make it cheaper? Simply enter DUDE20, which is an exclusive discount code that will give you a 20% discount from your purchases. Then enter your payment details and you should immediately receive the key once the payment has been confirmed. After receiving the key, you can then activate your software or games instantly. Let us now go to our desktop so that I can demonstrate it to you on how can you disable your Windows Defender on your Windows 11. Alright, now that we are on our desktop, we are going to be disabling Windows Defender permanently on Windows 11. However, this might be a little bit different compared to what you were used to before when you are disabling Windows Defender or Windows Security on Windows 10. As Windows 11 has a tighter measures or security measures before you could actually disable Windows 11. So to cut the disclaimer, we can now go ahead and go to the start menu and look for MS config and then go to the system configuration app. We are going to be booting on a safe mode boot option. So go to the boot tab until you see the boot options right here and check the safe boot and make sure to set it as minimal. Hit the apply button and okay. And currently we are going to exit without restart. Just to confirm that Windows security is currently running on our computer, go ahead and go back to the start menu and look for Windows security and open up the Windows security app. So as you can see, the virus and threat protection is currently turned on on my computer. So we are now going to be restarting our computer so we can actually disable that particular Windows security feature on Windows 11. Alright, now that we are successfully in the safe mode option on our Windows 11, we can now go ahead and change some settings on our registry. So let's now go to the start menu, right click on it and click on the run option. Go ahead and type in here, reg edit, and hit the OK button. So you'll be shown with this particular registry editor window. We are going to be going to the H key local machine, and then go to the system folder. Look for the current control set folder here, and then under the services, we are going to be disabling some particular services right here. So we are going to be maximizing this window so that you could see it far here. So we are going to be scrolling down under the services until we see the census or rather the sense service right here. As you can see, we're going to be changing the start key right here to the four value under the hexadecimal base and hit the OK button. And then we are going to be looking for the WD boot It's going to be scrolling down until you see the WD boot right here and also set the start key to 4 with hexadecimal base and hit the OK button. Next, we're going to be changing the WD filter and change the start value to 4 under the hexadecimal base, hit the OK button. Next, we're going to be looking also for the WD NIS DRV and then go ahead and update the start type or the start value to 4 and set the base to hexadecimal and hit the OK button. Then go to the WD NIS SVC and then we are going to be setting the start reg value also to 4 and set the base to hexadecimal. Hit the OK button. And lastly, we are going to be looking for the win defend and then we're going to be updating this one also with a value of 4. The same hexadecimal base. Next, just simply hit the OK button and we have successfully disabled Windows Defender. I'll be showing on the screen the default values so that in case you want to re-enable Windows Defender, you could just simply re-update all the settings with the default value that is currently shown on the screen. So we can now go ahead and close this registry editor and then go ahead and go to the start menu and right click on it and click on the run button and type in here msconfig and hit the OK button, go to the boot tab and uncheck the save boot under the boot options. Hit the apply and OK and restart your computer. And right now we are on the normal mode on our Windows 11 and to check whether we've successfully disabled Windows Security or Windows Defender on our Windows 11 operating system, go back to the start menu and look for Windows Security. 
I go ahead and open up the Windows Security app and you will notice that under the virus and threat protection it will just be stuck under the getting protection info and it will never load up actually the Windows security service on your computer. So that's basically it. That's how you disable Windows Defender or Windows security on your Windows 11. So hopefully by the end of this video, you are now able to disable Windows Defender on your Windows 11 operating system. If in case you want to disable it on your Windows 10 system, just click on this video right here. And also don't forget to subscribe on this channel. Again, it's your tech here. See you in my next tech videos.